In this lesson, you will learn about adding decimals. So here we have two decimals to add together, 44 and 36 hundredths, added to 27 and 4 tenths. When you add decimals, you need to remember that you have to line up your decimal points. So your decimal points have to be lined up. So we take our first number, 44 and 36 hundredths, we're going to add it to 27 and 4 tenths. 27 and 4 tenths. We can put a placeholder zero here, okay? And we are adding, okay? So now we simply add. Our decimals are lined up. We simply add six plus zero is six. Three plus four is seven. Our decimal point is still lined up. We bring it down. Seven plus four is 11. Four, five, six, seven. So 44 and 36 hundredths plus 27 and 4 tenths is 71 and 76 hundredths. Okay. Here we have some more decimals with different decimal places as well. What we need to remember is to line up our decimals. So 13 and 1 tenth. Then we have 7 and 62 hundredths. This one's really tricky. 12 and 1, 2, 3 zeros and a 7. So that's 7 tenths, hundreds, thousands, ten thousandths. 7 ten thousandths. So in order to help me keep everything lined up, I'm going to go back and put in placeholder zeros. So I'll even make those a different color. Placeholder zero there, placeholder, 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 placeholder. That helps keep things lined up so you don't get mixed up. And now I simply add. That's seven and a zero and two, seven. Bring down my decimal, make sure I have my decimal. 10, 11, 12, and three. One, two, three. Okay, so 13 and 1 tenth added to 7 and 62 hundredths added to 12 and 7 ten thousandths gives you 32 and 7,207 ten thousandths. That's the end of our lesson on adding decimals.